Coming up, clubs are back in action this week. Another spotlight on poetry thanks to National Poetry Month, a preview of upcoming track season, and of course, all this week's news and so much more. You're watching Titan TV by students for students. This is Titan TV, coming to you live on tape from Northside Middle School Studio 105. Today is Monday, April 12, 2021. Now let's take it to the new studio with Judah. Welcome back, Titans, to your NMS News. I am Judah, and I will be your captain of the ship today. Mm -mm. Sorry, it just feels like we have an aquatic theme if you look closely at the props in our news studio. Enough with this nonsense. Let's get to the news. This week will be Makeup I Learn practice testing. If you weren't here last week, you will be called up to take the practice test at some point this week. Horace Mann will be bringing in treats this week for our teachers to celebrate how awesome they are. This Thursday is our Titan Band Spring Concert. This concert will feature multiple bands from Muncie Central, Southside, and of course, Northside. These performances are from their clinic at Central this past Saturday. Make sure to tune in to Titan TV's YouTube channel at 7 p.m. on Thursday. The NMS Spring Play Charlotte's Web is being performed on Friday, April 16th at 7, and on Saturday, April 17th at 2 and 7. Tickets will go home with the cast members for their families only. Teachers are also invited to attend. Please make sure to wear your mask and social distance while in the auditorium. Well, that's all I have for news right now. Let's hear about the weather we will experience this week from Elena. Today will be mostly sunny with temperatures in the high of 68 degrees and the low of 43 degrees. The rest of the week looks to be much of the same, with temperatures in the 50s and the 60s, but with the cooler temps in the morning on your bus ride. Today is National Only Child Day, so for all of you spoiled kids out there, this is for you. Enjoy all those baby books filled with pictures and memories. Now it's time for Sports with Dreaded. What's up, Titans? It's time for Sports with Dreaded, hosted by me, yeah, Drevin, today we're going to give you a preview of our upcoming track season. So get those calendars out and mark down these dates. But first, let me go into my Drevin box. That's better. First, we'll start off the season with the Titans facing the Panthers, Muncie Northside versus Muncie Southside at Yorktown Middle School. The meet starts at 5 p.m. on April 19th. Next, we'll feature the Northside Titans and Burris Owls. This event will take place on Ball State's track on Wednesday, April 21st at 5.15 p.m. That next Wednesday, the Titans will face Anderson Highland and Elwood here in Muncie. The meet will take place at Muncie Central's football stadium on April 28th at 5.30 p.m. Skip ahead two more days and it will be time for our city championship. This will take place at Ball State on Friday, April 30th, starting at 5.15 p.m. To kick off the May portion of this track season, the team will host Delta Middle School at the Muncie Central Football Stadium on May 4th, starting at 5.30 p.m. Summa will be the next school to come over to Central Football Stadium to face the Titans. The meet will start at 5.30 p.m. on Monday, May 10th. Wednesday, May 12th, will feature the Titans traveling to the Newcastle Middle School. The meet begins at 5 p.m. Then, to the end of the season, and the entire school year of sports will be the Union City Invitational at Union City Junior Senior High School. The invite is on Friday, May 14th, beginning at 5.30 p.m. What a season! We hope to see you at one or more of these events. Now let me out of my Drevin box, please. Thank you. 
That's all we have today for Sports with Drevin, hosted by me, Yo! Drevin. Let's hear what Titans are going to be celebrating their day of birth this week. Elena? Thanks, Drevin. Here are the Titan birthdays for this week. Amir S., Jonah V., Daniel K., Charles D., and Jaylee M. Now it is time for Trivia Challenge. Last week, answers was Robert Frost. Here's the top five on the leaderboard. First is Jackson's class with 60 points. Second is Cardi's class with 45 points. Third is Newman's class with 40 points. Fourth is Gilbert's class with 35 points. And fifth is Teal's class with 30 points. This quarter, we are going to separate points for first and fifth period classes. So make sure to send in those trivia challenge answers. Due to National Poetry Month, we will read a part of a poem and you will figure out who this poet is. Make sure to listen carefully if you need to go back and rewatch this part when the broadcast is over. There is a place where the sidewalk ends and before the street begins. And there the grass grows soft and white, and there the sun burns crimson bright. And the moon bird rests from his flight, too cool in the peppermint wind. Who wrote this poem? Send in answers to nmstitantv at gmail.com. Also make sure to wait till the very end of the broadcast after the credits to send in your answers. That is all for Trivia Challenge. Now it is my pleasure to present a new segment called Poetry Pour Over featuring our Titan TV players. It's time for our Poetry Pour Over featuring our Titan TV players. In honor of National Poetry Month, each week we will read a poem and have our Titan TV players act out the poem at the same time. Warning, we do not promise that this will be educational at all. Today's poem is Monosyllabics by Laura E. Richards. The black cat sat in the fat man's hat. Oh dear, the fat man said. May the great grey bat catch a bat black cat who has left me no hat for my head. A large red cow tried to make a bow but did not know how, they said for her legs got mixed and her horns got fixed and her tail would get in her way. A sad thin ape bought some wide white tape to trim a new cape for his niece. But a bold rough calf with a loud rough laugh bit off one whole half for his geese. This has been our poetry pour over featuring our Titan TV players. Now let's go back to the news studio with Haley Grace. Thank you, Aaliyah. That was interesting. But it is time for some news again. Let's look at what clubs are meeting this week here at Northside. Homework help is held every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday in the cafeteria after school until 5 p.m. Please come straight to the cafeteria and check in with Mrs. Pierce or Miss Jackson. Ride should be here at 5 p.m. to pick you up. Make note that academic bowl teams will meet during third lunch on Blue Days in Dr. Carter Solaris' room. Enjoy your lunch and enjoy diving into women's history. Wednesday mornings are when things get jazzy here at Northside. Jazz Club with Mr. Teeple meets on Wednesday at 8.15 down in the band room. Make sure to enter the building at door 8. Thursday features our Safe Hero Club. They will meet from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. in Miss Nevada's room. FCA will meet this Friday morning in the choir room. Make sure to enter the building at door 8 at 8.15. Greenhouse Club will meet Friday as well. We have some reports that some plants are starting to sprout up. Come on down to Mr. Bracken's room from 4 p.m. to 5 on Friday to help these plants grow. And finally, Pokemon Club will return this Friday. Join Mr. Grimm in the library from 4 to 5 p.m. If you're staying after school for a club or sports practice, remember to go by the cafeteria to get an afternoon meal, then go straight to your meeting. Do not wander the halls. If you are not staying after school for a club or practice, please get your meal and go home. And with that, our broadcast has come to an end. Our Titan TV crew has been very hard at work behind the scenes, so check those names out at the end. Also, make sure to check our social media pages and smash that subscribe button on YouTube. From all of us here at Titan TV, I'm Haley Grace, and this has been your NMS News by students for students. Stay classy, Titans. Let me go and
my dreadlocks. No, no, Trevor, you gotta stay there. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> this is my bae for real. Me and Bay post the love. <laughs> This has been a... There's a mower! Is the mower crossing the road or is he just gonna stand there and make noise? The mower's gonna get hit by a car. <laughs> Production.